State health officials on alert after a food poisoning outbreak sickens potentially dozens of people here in Middle Tennessee. News Channel 5's Nick Barris uncovered this exclusive story. He says the illness emerged after a fundraiser for a volunteer fire department in Rutherford County. The money raised at this fundraiser pays for important equipment like this, badly needed by an important volunteer fire department. The problem is this time, people got sick. Salmonella can can be uh, very serious and can cause death in some people. Deputy State Epidemiologist John Dunn says reports of the illness are serious. No one's died, but several are sick, some hospitalized. We know of um, uh, a number of others, 18 total so far, and we're, we're hearing about more ill individuals. All of them attended uh, the Las Casas Fire Department fish fry on September 10th. More than 400 people attended the event at the station on Las Casas Pike in Rutherford County. The meal included fried fish and chicken along with homemade white beans, other sides, and an array of desserts. Since then, many were sickened by salmonella and shared on Facebook. This woman lost 15 pounds. Another ended up in the hospital, and one was sick for over a week and still not 100 percent. But when we hear about multiple cases, an outbreak, as in this case, um, we become more concerned and take a much more aggressive role in investigating to try to prevent other people from becoming ill. Dunn says anyone who ate at the event and is sick with the telltale nausea and diarrhea should go to their doctor. Then they may hear from the state. They want to ask them questions about what they ate. But for now, the cause of the salmonella outbreak remains a mystery. State health department officials say outbreaks like this happen only two or three times a year in Tennessee. And the fire department officials, they say, are cooperating fully as they search to find Find out the source of the illness. In Las Casas, Nick Barris, News Channel 5. Nick, thanks. This is the first time something like this has ever happened at a Las Casas volunteer fire fundraiser. State officials say such outbreaks can happen anywhere by accident in food preparation or if meals have already arrived contaminated.